Hello everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Agmin. I'm in front of you today to share some good news about uh, some of the new developments uh, in immigration and especially for the spouse and children of green car holder. Uh, as you know, green car holder has a right to file for their spouse, you know, wife or husbands and or children's or kids uh, green cards. And but usually the process, uh, it, the way it works is the green card holder has to apply to immigration for their spouse and children's green card, petition them for their immigrant visa. And then they have to wait for the visa processing times, basically by checking the State Department visa bulletin monthly to see if the priority dates are current or the uh, either it's, it's almost where they're cases are so uh, usually uh, we have to follow the you know this bulletin monthly until up to this month uh, the visa waiting time for spouse and children under 21 years old of green card holders were around July of 2017 but just a couple days ago the new visa bulletin came out for July of 2019 basically for next month and then the visa bulletin shows that the numbers visa numbers are current that means the green card holders spouses and children under 21 who have been waiting for their priority dates in order to for them to get the green card it's going to be current next month so that way they can actually move on to the second step of filing for their green card and secondly if you marry the green card holder uh, or you are the children of to under 21 years of age of green card holder, your green card holder spouse or parent can apply for you right away now and you will be able to apply to green card part, you know, starting next month. So that's a great news. But what we have to pay attention is and or for more followers we're getting you know several questions about this new development and one of the questions of course is about oh so i am in overseas or i am in the us so what is the process if i'm here or if i'm not here what do i have to do this is the main question that we're getting right now basically what i could tell you is this if you're in overseas that means and if your spouse or your parents apply for your green card and you're waiting for your green card processing time that means now they can move on to the second step and for you to be able to schedule for immigrant visa appointment at the U.S. consulate in your home country. So that's the one way if you're in overseas. Of course, if you're in the U.S., then if your spouse or your you know parents apply for your green card and you're just waiting for your prior to dates, that means then you can apply for adjustment of status during next month without waiting. That way you'll be able to process your case, will be able to apply for work permit and travel permit during next month. So that's actually very good uh, development. And what I could tell you is it was like four or five years ago when there was a time uh, the processing time became current for spouse and children of the green card holders. And back then there was a time, waiting time was almost five years. And all of a sudden they opened the, you know, the built-in and the, it was current and all the spouses and kids of the green card holder were able to get their green card, apply for their uh, green card all, or if they apply already, they were able to receive or do the final actions to able to receive their green card. So it's same thing uh, which is going to happen next month and the visa category for spouses and children under 21 years of age of green card holder, uh, their cases are going to be current so they can able to get their green card and or immigrant visa right away. Another question we received from our followers, so how long is this going to be open? How long? The visa bulletin is going to show, uh, you know, green card holders, spouses and children's cases are going to be current. So that's hard to say. Uh, but what we could say is that since we are getting closer to fiscal year, this might not be too long. It could be maybe a month or a couple months of where the visa bulletin is current. Then it could actually retract, you know, it could go back to actually, uh, you know, a little longer waiting time. So this is why it's critical for you to take advantage of this. If you already have cases pending, you should move on to second step. If not, you can uh, have your spouse or you know parents apply for you right away. Another question we receive from our followers due to this new development is they're saying, well, you know, we're in the US, but we do not have a legal status or, you know, my husband or parent, they have a status, I mean, they're green card holders of a couple of years. So, but what can we do now? Can we get a green card? because of this new development. But the key here is this, in order spouses and children under 21 years of age of green card holder to receive green card, if you're in the US, 
you have to have a legal status. If you don't, you have to wait for your spouse or parents who has a green card to become a U.S. citizen. Then they will be able to apply for you. So this is actually very good news and I hope that spouses and kids of green card holder can take advantage of this uh, new development and should you have any questions feel free to reach us or office. We'll be glad, we'll be happy to assist you in these cases and in, in these proceedings. So feel free to call us at 212-245-7070 or you can reach us at info at email address. Thank you so much and have a good day. <music>